Hello everybody, my name is the Fireman and welcome to episode 8 of our Let's Play on Bramshaw Farm. Uh, not Bramshaw Farm. <laughs> um, ta on Taste of Donegal. Um, right. So we've got the 8340 here with a loader on and bale forks and a weight. Um, I've fed the cows the three John Deere bales what we made. Uh, I will just update you what happened. So I wanted to change the bale textures to the one that I had, the old one, but that meant that meant swapping the baler. So now we've got a class Roland, um, and I've also just sold the John Deere. So that's all. We've, that's all I've really done. I sold the John Deere and bought that. The Dominator's finished with the fields. It is quite mucky, but it's finished. Uh, we've got sixty-three thousand pounds. You may notice that it says day one Monday. I have the real time mod, I think it's called, which puts it all in. Uh, but unfortunately, the time on this computer is really messed up for some for some weird reason. It says it's twenty-three eighteen. It is actually uh, nineteen minutes one twenty past uh, five. So we need to buy a bale trailer. I have got. A I have got one or two. I have that one and the Marshall one. And the Marshall one's a bit big. This one may just be big enough to get round to it. I don't know if it has a locking script or not. Um, we may not need a bale trailer, but I just want to have one. Just because we can then have one. So we're going to go pick that up with the John Deere. We have 52,000. I also had... Someone asked me to get a Fiat... Fiat Agri, Agri 19960, 16090. So I've got that there, and I've got two class there just in case we want them. I've also got a Massey Ferguson 6499. So I'm slowly building the mods back up. Uh, we've got John Deere mowers, which we might buy, which we probably will buy actually because we need to start mowing. We should probably start that fairly soon. Uh, cultivators. That's what we want as well, but they're all like a hundred pounds. Well, they're all a hundred horsepower. Right, so we'll go pick. We'll go pick it up. I haven't got the steering wheel set up fully yet, so that's why I'm still using the keyboard. But I will. I'm going to attempt to do it for episode nine. Now you may all notice, or you may all remember that I did a stream the other day, and it was actually quite quite good. So that was just, I just did a stream on Spring Hill, which people have asked, can we do that as an actual thing? I thought instead of doing a let's play on that map, we'll just do that. We'll literally stream for an hour, half, an hour and a half. Like if we do it once a week or something. Oh, shit. Too busy concentrating on Mobius. Come on, Tractor. So yeah, we need a windrow as well because we've got that big field over there to do. We might go get the class one. Right, I don't know whether this trailer has locking script or not. Uh, oh yes, it does. It says uh, attach load X for ramps. Oh, so if we want to take something that's really slow on this trailer, we can. Engage narrow ramps, uh, or no. Enlarge ramps, narrow ramps. I see is for the tractor. Alright, so you get. And I've also got cosplay in. Yes. I haven't got hood hider in yet, though. Oh god. I need to concentrate on the bloody road. So we're going to stack them bales today. I don't know how many we're going to get done. But we're gonna stack them and then stack them and then I'll uh, buy a windrow on screen. I think we'll go for the class, the class one that was in the let's play, which was in the Spring Hill stream, and we'll use that one instead. But yes, uh, I'm hoping you all enjoy. I still haven't actually uploaded the first the episode seven of this, but I'm hoping you all. Are enjoying it. Episode 7 will be out tonight. 
Right, so I've put the trailer, trailer in there where there's, the lime is meant to be. Uh, right. So let's sort of just, we're just sort of going to go to the middle of the field and leave it there. We'll just sort of leave it running. So if we just click, alright, it doesn't work with nothing on it. No, sometimes you can get them to work with even nothing on. Right. So we'll hide the animal hood because we don't need that. We can't actually hide our hood yet because I haven't got hood hider in. Open the door. Get in. Shut the door. Fire this weird thing up. Bump. Right, we're going to stack them two by two. So we'll just sort of. Ooh. Why can't we do this in cap? One. No, that's E. So we'll grab this one and grab this one. I can't remember how many bales are in this field. I think it's. I don't think it's too many though. Uh, right. Let's open that window. You can't open the roof on this one. I don't think. No. Just I'm gonna make sure they're okay on the trailer though. For the love of God, do not roll anywhere. Alright, I don't mind rolling there. So if we go attach load release line. Alright, so if we leave it unattached, put the next set of bales on. This is how much trust I have in my own abilities. I am actually going to leave the bales that I've just put on unattached. Now we're we're only gonna we're gonna keep this load of bales for doing our cows, and then whatever we get out of field 22 is just gonna go straight for sale and try and boost our profits back up. Because I want to get that Fiat and have free tractors uh, and then get some cultivators and stuff going. We also need to get a John Deere mower because we're going to do some mowing soon. Right, so we get another two. Yeah, we're going to go out and do some mowing. Um, we want to do some mowing so we can start really feeding the cows. Oh, another thing. I downloaded a Clash Jag 8700 and apparently it's only costing £100 to buy. We're not going to buy that. We might go for this though, the key KIR.1.5 mil. It cuts grass, wheat, barley and corn. So if we wind rode it, we could probably pick it up with that. Which give us a lot of silage. I've also got the class easy pick up. 300. Uh, we may need to get a silage trailer just to use that machine with. I think that's chaff. I can't really remember. Just have a quick look. Yeah, that's chaff. So that'll take chaff and so will that, I think. Or is that chaff? Oh well. I think they take the same. I think, I think they still take. I think they both take the same thing. But anyway, right. So we'll have to get one of them if we're going to use that machine. I don't want to use the class because it's massive and I don't really feel like putting this game onto a multiplayer. Right, I forgot to do that. When you start the game with this loader attached to something, the parts that attach to this bit go all funny and you have to lift the loader right in the air for them to all line up again. So. Oh, I 
think that's enough gap. We'll leave it like that. Another two, and then there's just one more to pick up. So it hasn't actually been that bad. Uh, We'll just sort of we'll put the one on this loader and drive back with it, and we'll just put the other. So like this is going to go this side. This is where I knock it all off. Come on, because I can't see how close that bale is to that loader. Judging there. Everything stayed on. Everything stayed on. Wait, lock it down. The way I test if, if it's all locked down is do a sharp corner or brake. Pick up a bit of speed and then actually just slow down. Well, try and brake as hard as you can. Go stack this one. I don't know what shed to put them in there. I think we'll put them back in the shed that they were originally in. I think that makes a bit more sense. But I think this loader might be a, a touch too big to fit in. Oh no, there's miles of them. I honestly thought the door was so much more narrow. field that we want. Uh, I think we'll mow field 20. I'll do, if we buy a mower I'll do some course by courses off screen for field like 20 and 21. And, well field 27, 21 and all them lot. But let's purchase. So we want to buy There's not really much difference in them, is there? No. Brake, wind drive, 24,000. And the mower is going to cost us about 9,000. But I don't want to buy that just yet because of... I don't want to go too low in money because we've still got to cultivate this field, seed it, spray it. We still need to actually purchase a sprayer. I think I might go find a modded one. I think I've, I know where some good ones are. And get a modded sprayer. So there's the slurry pit, right? You've got to remember it's there on that corner. So if we sort of put that there. They should be unattached. Yes, they are. God, this is going to be like the biggest pain in the ass because that international is quite small. It would actually quite, it actually quite happily go around this. But eight three forties are a little bit bigger, and do not tend to like cornering very much. No, I can't get close enough. Actually, I might be able to. Oh, that's it. Just sort of wriggle our way in and back out. Let's lift that above the trailer. Go that way, you dickhead. Go that way, you dickhead, mate. That's on 40 minutes, so we might, we may actually be able to just do a bit of wind rowing. We'll t I think we'll take the Massey up to do that. Push that there. Right, pull the tractor forward. 
gently. Lock the load. So this is actually going to be really handy for doing the other field. Now I actually found... Oh shit, I need to push the other bales off because, you know, I'm not using a steering wheel. I soon will be there. I think I know what was the problem with it. But if it doesn't work, then we'll have to keep using the keyboard till I figure out why it doesn't work. So it's actually going to be quite handy for when we do far away fields. Um, I might even do a course by course of field 6, which is a, a fairly big, actually it's probably the biggest grass field on this map, I think. If I remember rightly, I think it is. Oh, fuck, no. Come on, link on. So move the forks up and down until it goes in. See, in the cab, that was like pretty much really close, but here. Oh, and I've put the ramps down as well. Accidentally. Right, we'll sort of just stack these at the back. And done. Right, so that's one set of bales done, out the way. Uh, X to put that away and it? it still has the animations even if even in FS15. Right, so if we kind of just pull this right over here. And still put the bale trailer in the grass. Nice grassy area for it. And then we'll go pick up the windrow, but we want to bring. Actually, no, we'll just. Oh god, go away, lights. Lights cause lag. We'll put that there. Get out. Shut the door. No, I put the tubes back on so I didn't have to pipe, spike them in the ground, otherwise, you probably would have had to. Now, we're going to go pick. We're just going to go get the wind row and go straight to field 20. Um, field 22, we're not going to... Not going to get the cultivator yet. We'll, I'll bring that back once I'm done. Which won't be in this episode, it'll be in... We'll probably see... You'll probably see the cultivator back and the Ford actually doing it. More than likely. This is quite difficult now because I now I don't have a tractor that I can just dedicate to do stuff. Like I'm gonna have to use one of these big things to do like the seeding and the the spraying and all that. Cause I can't I can't send the 8340 to go out cultivating until all the bales are back and sold. And even then we might just be able to just use this massy. Glass windrow, nice and clean, brand spanking new from the shop. So I'll windrow this up, and then I'll course play, of course, me mowing it and all that stuff. Not me mowing it, windrowing it, not not even windrowing it, cultivating it and seeding it, spraying it, and then I'll do the same for field ten, and then hopefully we can start episode nine. If I find a good sprayer off screen that's nice and cheap, then I'll probably buy it. I'll try and find that big one that we actually had on this save game before it all went to shit. And that nice little red one that we had for actual fertilizer. And I still haven't found the 118 Massey. The 188 Massey, I should say. Unfortunately. But anyway, thank you all for watching. Leave a like down below if you enjoyed. Subscribe more today. And I shall see all of you in the next episode. Happy farming. Bye-bye.